I know you can't tell me much about Craven the Hunter, mm -hmm. but what's it like stepping into the... Okay. I know, we're looking. I'm looking Who's for the snipers. The fast, <laughs> I'm looking for the Marvel Everybody snipers. Knows that these mob, they're, they're, they're assassins. They're, they're crazy. But you're stepping to the MCU and Spider-Man as a villain. What is that like? This character... That's it. Ah! <laughs> okay, okay. okay, I'll give you a bit more than that. This character is just someone I am really, um, I'm really behind, man. I'm really excited about what we can uh, we can do with this character. He's really interesting. He's got a really great backstory that we're hoping to share, and it's gonna be different, man. It's gonna be a little bit different. Okay. So, what? Remember those two wackos from the Bolivia job? The twins? Yeah, I'm not so sure they're twins. Get off the train. So, you and Brian Tyree Henry, yeah. twin assassins in this movie. Right. The MCU tentacles keep y'all yeah. close. They keep y'all close. I know. It's dangerous. <laughs> what was it like teaming up with him on this film? Oh my god, it was everything. You know, like, I didn't know who my character Tangerine was until he stepped into the shoes of Lemon. I mean, he's such a talented, versatile actor. I mean, I've watched so much stuff of his and so. It was a blessing, really, because, you know, he stepped on and then we was just instantaneously, like, we connected, you yeah. know, as, like, friends and, like, real, feel like a real brotherhood. So, like, um, I'm grateful for him, man, you know, and it was that trust that made us just kind of riff and kind of improv and do our thing, you know, that's that little bit of magic. Just so he rare. said the same thing. He said you're now his emergency contact. Yeah, that's right. I know this. I know this. <laughs> But you know, he's definitely not mine because he's busy working all Thank the time. Thank you. Every time I call him, I'm like, bro, you gotta come around. He's like, oh man, he's in Australia tomorrow. He's I just he told him. Canada. He was in Atlanta. He was shooting Atlanta in London for a minute and then he went back. I can't, he just doesn't sit still. I told him, I said, you look up booked and busy in the dictionary. It's you. It's the picture of you. Yeah. But okay, okay, second thing, Aaron, I have heard from several different sources, meaning your castmates, that this cast is actually a band. Oh. And the name of the band is? Yeah, Naked Below the Line. <laughs> it's a thing. And Brian said yeah. the first album is called No Harness. <laughs> yeah. With the harness is something nasty. <laughs> but the rehearsals, I mean, it's something you don't want to see. It's just. Are you horrendous. the drummer? Are you the bass player? Are you. Listen, we're still figuring things out. Okay. Like, it's, we're still experimenting. But Brad's the manager and he's in the band? Oh, Brad's been carrying a guitar case around. There's no guitar in it. It's got his dirty laundry in it. But he carries the guitar case everywhere we go. That is real. But we don't know how good he is yet. So we don't really know. We got okay. him on the spot. Okay, I can do it. I can do it. We have seen you guys just really bonded. And it does feel like you're a family. You really like each other. That chemistry, That's you can't... like, huh? <laughs> Yeah, we're doing a good job. You're about to go out on your we're own solo active, project okay. and leave the band? We have had this weird freaking family love affair. Like, it's yeah. been crazy. Like, we came and made this movie in a pandemic. Like, we needed each other, you know? We kind of, like, had, we just sort of, like, infiltrated each other. And then Brian's got this big, light, joyous his laughter, is infectious, and we just need each other, you know? We kind of came in each other's lives at the right moment when we needed uplifting, and then we made this movie in the dark time, and we created something that, you know, we won't disappoint. People are gonna, gonna laugh, you know? That's good. I love that. We need to laugh.